Hello. Hello. We are starting this video in the mirror because we're gonna be doing a workout challenge, me and Spencer. I was just gonna do it with me and my friends and have them keep track of me, but Spencer says he wants to do it as well. Because I'm like a workout freak, so why not? And yeah, why not? So you don't have to do this part, but I wanna film my body before and after. So will you film it for me? No. What? I'm not gonna help you. Come Why? Kind of I'm letting you work out with me. What kind of brother would I be if I helped my sister? Come I'm on. letting you use my paints. I got you a dog. Hey. Hey. I got you an animal. Help me out. Got me an animal. I can just go outside and look at a fox and go, ooh, I want that one. Yeah, but I got you an actual animal. Is a fox not an actual animal? No, I got you a pet. Oh, whatever. You know what I mean. Help me out. <laughs> Are you ready to start the video? Sure, are you gonna make one of those 1980s workout videos? Oh, you know it. Let's bit. start the workout. Oh, hey. Oh, 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 oh,
I know I'm being a little dramatic. That's hard. But it's okay. It, was, it wasn't terrible. It was just like harder than I was expecting. Like just a little harder. I was like, oh wait, we don't get any breaks in between. No, five seconds. That's five seconds. That, that's how long it takes me to get into the next position. Also giving away three Apple Watches so it puts your abs even more. Or you can choose to not lower your legs down as much. Look at her. Yes, I do see I do this all the time. Next, remember squeeze your abs each time you breathe out. I don't think so. I'm done. What is that? Yes. Did you get copyrighted for this? <laughs> Oh my god, I'm Hello, thanks for joining us for our first exercise, our first day on the challenge. Spencer says he wants to do all the challenges with me, which might be good because then I can get like competitive and keep up and whatever. Oh, you're going to no. get competitive. You're not even going to be close. You're going to give up the third day, I bet. No, I want to stay on it. It was really hard today, but I feel like if I keep going and giving it my all, it'll get easier. I'll bet five bucks you give up on the sixth day. Okay, you're on. <laughs> I'm pretty sure the sixth day is a rest day, so that's <laughs> okay. So oh, oh. Anyways. Ten days, you won't make it through. Thanks for joining us. We'll show you, we might show you like the midway point, and then we'll show you the after. So, we'll see you soon. Hello, I'm here to update you about my workout. Currently it is day, uh, day nine. Currently it's day nine. The reason that took me so long to figure out is because I kind of messed up my whole schedule. I, um, so for like, I'll show you. So they have the whole schedule on here, right? So basically day six actually went on a hike instead of working out and then I was gonna work out this day and then I didn't work out either day, right? And so then last night, uh, am I messing up my days again? No. So then the other night to catch up, I did day six and then I was gonna do day eight yesterday and then skip my next day off. But then I didn't do my workout yesterday, so now I'm two days behind. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do this one right now, which it's like 1.30 right now. And then I think I'm gonna do this one after cake tonight, cause I ha I'm having cake, so I'm gonna work that off. But yeah, especially cause like, then there's a 50 minute one. And then that way, I think either way, I still have to skip my rest day, but then I can keep going. So yeah, we're about to work out and try to catch up. So now it's time for the booty and the legs. <laughs> Hi, next day. So I decided not to do two different workouts in the same day because I am so sore just from the first workout I did. So it's like, mm, we're not doing another one. So, oh my God, I almost dropped my phone. So I decided that instead my next two off days, I'm just gonna skip the off days and move on to the next day in hopes that I catch myself back up. So we'll see how that goes, but time to do another workout. Hello, okay, so today is day 13 ish kind of yeah day 13 so technically i'm a day behind so it's day 13 for me but it should be day 14 but i didn't i haven't been on schedule i'm gonna do my midway check-in i'm gonna see and like show how i'm improving if i haven't improved i'm gonna take my measurements which i actually think i'm gonna take tomorrow morning after i go to the bathroom because i read somewhere that's like the best time to do it and that's what i did last time i measured the day after i did my first workout i measured that next morning so i think that's what i'm gonna do this time just so it's like truly the day like the the midway point but yeah so i'm about to do that which i am so sore so if i look stupid during these exercises that's why because i skipped my last rest day and uh today i had to do like 30 extra minutes of a workout because last night when i was doing my workout i forgot to do it until like midnight so i started doing it and of course this little dog was hanging out with me and he was all rambunctious and he has found out what humping is and so anytime i was doing a workout with my butt in the air he started humping me and biting me so i was like mm, great i am not working out with the dog <laughs> humping me so i was like i'll just finish it tomorrow so i finished it and then i went on a two-hour hike <laughs> so i'm sore and i'm about to work out again for another 35 minutes so we're living but i'm gonna go pee first
Actually, I have no storage on my phone, so I'm not gonna record me exercising, but I will record how I feel afterwards and like a review of my midway, how I'm feeling, and I'll record in the morning me measuring myself. I really consider this video a fail video, so if you guys want to see me do this one over again, let me know. If you want to see me do any kind of other exercise videos, let me know because I really enjoy them. I just don't know what I'm doing, <laughs> but I will show my results at the end, so stay tuned. Okay, just got through the first 15 minutes. I'm so tired. I'm learning that as I go through this workout, uh, through this whole month, a lot of the things that were like super, super unbearably hard in the beginning are a lot easier, even at the midway point, which I wasn't expecting that. It definitely still takes a breath away, but that's good. I'm showing progress already, so I'm fine. Like I'm doing great, but also I think I'm getting heartburn. So I'm gonna go take like a pill or whatever we have at the house for heartburn. And then I'm gonna get on to the next 20 minutes. Ooh. Also, I realize my time lapses <laughs> look like the flash. <laughs> I notice that my hair gets worse and worse through these workouts. Her hair stays so cute. I don't understand. Oh my god, I am out of breath. Um, a lot of those seem to like modified like cardio thing, cardi cardio things, which I like that workout. I like that it makes me out of breath and makes me sweat because like that means it's working. I do not know how the hell did she gets through those plank twists. They are so hard. I literally have to like stop for like two seconds after like twenty seconds of doing it max, and then I'm like, oh my god, I'm dying. They are so hard. Like I do them and I finish them, but like. Oh my god, she is a goddess. Like, I don't understand how she does these workouts all the time. I'm gonna do it because I want results. I wanna look nice. And if I don't get results this month, I'm gonna do another one. I got time. I'm in quarantine. Okay, 10 more minutes and then I'm going to bed. <sighs> Hello. Don't do extra days. <laughs> If you miss a day, don't do multiple in a day because it's not a good idea. <coughs> Sorry, I haven't drinking water yet. My second to last exercise was the hip dip like plank twists again. And I literally had to like stop halfway through and take such a long break because I was dying. Because if you skip days when you're not supposed to, it is so hard to bounce back. Just because I'm out of shape, I am not in good shape. I don't normally exercise like that much. So I was dying uh, since I forgot and I tried to fit two, basically two of the exercises exercises or the two workout days into one I literally like was about to throw up towards the end so I was like oh great should not have done this but I feel good I feel like I got a lot of work done I feel like I you know I tried I did good I've been trying so hard these last couple days 13 to be exact so I think Technically tomorrow's my rest day, but I'm still a day behind. So I think I'm gonna skip that rest day, which I just said not to do that kind of stuff, but whatever, like, I don't know. I, I'm just trying to stay on track from when I originally started. So we'll see what happens, but I'm so dead. It's so hot down here. So I'm gonna get changed and clean up a little and go to bed and I'll talk to you in the morning. Well, I guess I should talk a little bit about like how I'm feeling at my midway point because I'm not gonna wanna talk about it in the morning. Basically. You know, like I said before, as you keep working out, the workouts get easier. It's not like the workouts themselves are any less hard. Um, in fact, they get harder because she adds more. But because you're, you know, using your muscle memory and things like that, um, it becomes easier and it feels easier. Ugh. It doesn't help that I have tailbone problems, so a lot of these exercises hurt my back a lot. But it's okay. I'm doing fine. It's all for a good result. <laughs> But yeah, it's it's definitely super, super hard work. And by the end, my face is always like so red and I'm sweating. But you know what? It is so worth it. I feel so energized afterwards. Uh, even though I feel dead at the same time, I feel really good afterwards. And like, I feel like I'm getting something accomplished, which is something you should really look forward to, especially in these times of quarantine where like you literally have nothing to do. And I feel like for me, when I'm in quarantine, if I am such a busybody, I'm an Aries, hi. I'm also raised by an ADHD mother if I'm not doing something I feel like I am just not getting anything accomplished so I literally like I'm a busy bee so I like to have like 40 hobbies going at once to feel accomplished and like this is really helping just working out try to be normal getting your blood pumping and like I went on a hike today like going on hikes has been really helping and keeping up with hobbies and just things like that and like I think the reason this exercise like this challenge really helps is because it's a challenge it's like you know you 
you need to work hard to feel accomplished and get it done and whatever and working out and doing all this and pushing myself has really made me feel accomplished which I just think will make the results overall better because it's like I tried and that's all that matters and I really just want to get in the rhythm of working out so that once this whole program is over if I don't want to do another program at least I'll know like I'm comfortable working out and going to the gym and hopefully I won't be embarrassed because <laughs> that was my big issue was being embarrassed so love that I'm so dead I'm gonna go make sure I don't throw up because my teeth are numb see ya tomorrow for the measurement Hello, I just finished a workout. I just finished workout day 17. I'm supposed to be on day 18, but during day 16... Hey, did I just skip a day? No, I think I did that one. Anyways, either way, um, during one of the really long workouts, uh, my butt was really hurting. Like, the muscle right where the little, like, crease is on the bottom of the butt started really hurting. Like, it was really sore and it didn't feel right. So I just finished up my workout for that day and then I decided to give myself a rest day after that and then I was just gonna do, like, the two short ones the next day, and which is today. And it's one in the morning and I really need a shower. So I think instead of doing, um, both workouts tonight, I'm just gonna do the one be done tonight and then continue on as if I'm supposed to be on day 18 tomorrow you know just because I keep doing all these like oh I missed today so I'll make it up the next day oh I missed today I'll cancel my next rest day but I don't have two next rest days I only have one and I have to skip that one I'm just gonna go with it we're just gonna leave it as is so yeah so I'm gonna go shower I am doing terrible on my workout schedule. I haven't done my exercises for two days in a row. Basically, in the middle of my exercise, I got really scared because I thought I was seeing ghosts. And then I texted my dad, and it was like two in the morning. So he came downstairs and he laid in bed with me until I fell asleep. And that was two days ago or something. And I haven't done my workout today. So I'm just gonna pick up tomorrow. Hi guys, <laughs> clearly things are a lot different. I'm actually at the dorms now. It's actually months later. This video was from the very, very beginning of quarantine. Obviously some things happened and I also did not finish this workout. I got about, I had one week left, like one and a half. I just got so busy because I was finishing school and then I got a job right after and my job like ate up my entire life. So I just didn't end up finishing it. But I actually, I think I got the results I wanted from this physicality wise. I didn't really get the results I wanted just because like I wanted there to be a huge change for the video You know, I wanted to see something drastic but measurement wise I actually did get a big difference big for me big I thought it was great Like I it really made me feel good like being able to see the differences because I measured myself before and after and I'm gonna Talk about the measurements right now So in the beginning when I started at first my hips were 39 and a half inches and then my waist was 32 and my butt was 41 and a half and then midway my hips were still 39 and a half. My waist was actually 31 and a half and my butt was 42. So I gained and lost half an inch in my waist and my butt, which doesn't sound like a lot, but I was so proud of myself and it made me really excited just to like see a result in such a short amount of time because it was literally just two weeks and I was already seeing something and I just felt better. Like overall, like I felt healthier and I felt more motivated and just good. Like it just made me feel good to have something to do and have motivating. So Sorry if the lighting's weird, I'm in my dorm. I didn't finish it the way I was supposed to. I didn't really do it the way I wanted to, but I do think I got like the overall result I wanted because I wasn't entirely looking for like just physical goals. It was more of like an overall kind of a thing and I wanted to get into a habit, which it actually is helping me because I just went to the gym at my college for the first time yesterday with Jacob and it was really fun. I wasn't embarrassed. I didn't really know what I was doing because I don't know how any of the machine works, but it was really fun. We were there for about an hour and I worked on my legs and I did some arm stuff. He mainly did his arms. It was really cool. I was going to do cardio, but you still have to wear masks and stuff, so I didn't really do that. I wore my mask. I didn't do cardio because I was wearing masks, but I'm going to do cardio soon. I think that if you guys want a challenge and you want something that like is going to motivate you and make you feel healthier as like a kickstart to other things in your life, I think you should really try this. And because I didn't finish it. If you guys want me to, I will redo it and properly do it because she just posted like a brand new one for this year. So just let me know. But if you guys want me to try any like other types of like either diets or exercises or whatever, like I can really work with it because you know I'm at my dorms. So most of my food is paid for already because my parents paid for a meal plan, but I can try different diets and see how it works like being on campus. But yeah, let me know what you guys want to see. Thanks for watching. And I'm sorry I haven't posted in forever. I've been, same old excuse. I am I'm always so busy so I will get it done don't you worry thanks for watching bye